The intellectuals come in and say, property is theft, success is oppression. And then they look for the people in the village who are willing to move against those 20 successful people. Well, those guys at the bottom, those hundred resentful, jealous, murderous people at the bottom, they're just waiting for an opportunity to go kick down some doors. And that's exactly what they did in the 1920s. And as I said, they wiped out all their productive peasants. And then six million Ukrainians starved to death. They had posters. The Soviets produced posters in the 1930s that said, Essentially, don't forget it's wrong to eat your children. There's nothing that you can imagine that's horrible enough so that it matched the reality of what happened in the Soviet Union between 1919 and 1959. And, you know, the West knew about this, too. Early, Malcolm Muggeridge in the 30s was documenting for English newspapers exactly what was going on in the Soviet Union. Bloody intellectuals didn't admit it till the mid-70s, you know, with the exception of people like George Orwell.